how to avoid MailChimp from going into spam. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll simply guide you through the steps on how you can avoid MailChimp from going into spam. So make sure to watch the video till the very end. Now normally if, if you use the MailChimp service and when you try to send an email to someone it usually goes into the spam folder. And how do you actually fix that? Well in order to fix your MailChimp emails going into spam folder there are a couple of personalized settings that you can choose to make. First of all just go to MailChimp.com app or the website and you simply sign into your admin account. Once you've done that on the left hand side the first thing we can do is simply go to the audience tab and then here you'll find a section where it says all contacts you can just go to all contacts. Once you go to all contacts, what you want to do is on the right hand side of the screen, you'll find settings. You want to make sure to click the settings option and then go to the option called audience name and defaults. Once you go to this option known as audience name and defaults over here, you'll be able to see this information called campaign defaults. And then here you'll find default from email address. So whenever you're sending an email address to someone, just try to make sure that you use a personalized email address and avoid using words such as offer, discount or anything as such. Usually when you do that, the automated algorithm is going to determine that as a spam and it is most likely going to send your email into a spam folder. Now the other is however let's say you can just try to also verify your domain and to do so on the left hand side just go to the website section again and this time you want to simply go to domains. If you have purchased a domain from here you can search for your new domain and just connect it or you can simply click on add and verify domain make sure to enter the email address that contains the domain you want to verify send a verification email and then you should be good to verify them there on onwards. This way you can avoid your MailChimp going into spam folder. Hope this video was very helpful and if it did help you, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you have got any questions, then feel free to leave them down. Thank you for watching till the end and see you in the next video.